Lena and the Commander were supposed to get married, have a kid named Carl, who would go on to be a Raptor pilot, who would have a, a touch of the yellow slash Cylon fever, and give birth to Balsar Galactica Jesus slash and or Eve. But no! She had to be plugged into a god's damn computer. Silas! What the frack? Don't you defend her! Tell me where she is, I'm going to... Ugh. You're not going to do anything to First Sergeant Larson. She acted on my command. Anything you have to say to her, you say to me. You... She... Frack! It's not fair. As soon as we heard her voice... I can't imagine what you're going through, Sam. She was gone. I'd let her go. But now... She was my sister, Silas. How did I leave my sister behind? You couldn't have known. None of us could have expected this. Any of it. The universe is as cruel as it is fickle. If Helena's somehow still out there, I will find her. I can't leave her again. This fracking war be damned. I know. I'll be right here with you. <laughs> Frack you. Frack this war. Frack Sarkis. How many times are we going to clean up his fracking messes? He's... trying to do this right. Oh, come on! You're still going to defend him after he's fracked you over? Like this? You weren't even supposed to be out here. He promised us. He swore an oath you wouldn't be more than one jump away from your kid. And mine. Well, <laughs> I'm here now. How much can change that? We just have to trust that whatever damage we do out here is enough to help him close out the war. <laughs> I'm not sure there's anything else we can do. Never pegged you for a fatalist, Silas. <sighs> These are strange times, my friend. Get some rest while you can. No doubt Kane will call us soon for some new crisis. Wait, 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 wait. Silas Nash is Carl's father? No. What? No. What? But that... Uh, what the... Uh, I mean, maybe... Maybe... Uh... Samantha... Again, going back, I think Samantha and um, Lena's aren't actually sisters. I think Samantha might be Lena's mother. Um, because their relationship's very strange. I mean, did he, does she actually call her... Okay, she keeps calling her her sister, so maybe, but... Is... <gasps> Is <laughs> Silas Nash Carl Agathon's father? What? Ah, <laughs> oh, Slytherin, I love you. I hate you. This is awesome. Intel has finished decoding the traffic we pulled from the comms array. Nothing in there except for transfers from two weeks ago, which is no good to us now. However, the SIGINT thinks they found a Cylon Command mustering point based on some of the routing metadata. With luck, we'll find at least one of the ILs at the coordinates. Take out one of the heads, and we can start talking about sending people home. Mr. Singh, are these coordinates correct? This is quite a way inside of Sector 19. I raised the question, but Sigint is certain. It's a long jump for sure. Sir, Ghost Fleet is already overextended. The Cylons are well aware that we're out here now, and they're reinforcing what positions they have left. If we strike too far in, we risk the already tiny chance of making it back to the colonies. I concur with the Praetor. She has the experience in these matters. While I'm happy to see that you two can be in the same room without getting into a fist fight, our orders still stand. Admiral Sarkis sent us out here for results. You go back without them and you will be tried as a traitor. There's nothing I can do about that. Unlike Sarkis, or Ministry, or any of them back home, I understand our position out here. It's not my job to make you feel good about it. I don't have some pithy us-versus-them story to sell you. I'm just trying to get the work done so innocent people stop dying, and you can all go home. We're finished here. You all know what to do. Commander, 
Have the fleet ready for combat jump in 15 minutes. Oh, okay. First of all, uh, Larson and Agathon do not hate each other. They do not. I think they're kindred spirits, and I think they are besties. But the job had to be done. Also, fuck you, Kane. Said that an awful lot watching the show as well. Also, I feel like Lena's gonna show up again. I mean, listen, like, if you can, like, give her a body, like, number six. I mean, not number six's body. Like, you know, make her, like, the the human form Cylon. I'll, I'll take her. That would make me very happy. Intel has finished decoding the traffic we pulled from the comms array. Nothing in there except for transfers from two weeks ago. bet you that's why Carl's an Agathon and not a Nash. If Samantha needs to be out here because of some reason... I don't like this at all. If she has to be out here for some reason, then I wonder if it's because uh, she had a relationship with Nash and people are kind of embarrassed about it. Uh, I don't like this. This is a trap. This is a problem. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Jump complete, Dre. What the frack? There's no one here. Check your jump coordinates, Lieutenant. I swear, if you have fracked our jump. I watched his input, sir. We're at the right location. They knew we were coming. So? What do we do now? Fuck's sakes, we're out of fuel. Launching alert, Vipers. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Full defensive posture. Um, all Vipers launched, and let's just. Yeah, totally a trap. Totally a trap. God fucking damn it. Trap. Ghost Fleet, hear this precursor so that you fully understand this futility. You linger here, abdicating your responsibilities while we raise your homes. The Great Toron Plain is burning. Volunteer firefighters have been unable to stop the raging fires. Helena? Your moral weakness falls within expected probability parameters. Everything is connected. Your future remains predictable. It will be as God wants it to be. Sir, I'm not detecting any launches from the base star. It's just acting as a relay. I don't think Atropos or anyone else is actually on there. Mouthpiece or not, destroy the base star. You have your orders, Commander. This is a trap.
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This is a trap. This is a trap. How can you not see it? This is a fucking trap. Watch your animals, people. Kane! Nominal, RTS green. I'm good to go. Time to make a bunch of mama toasters cry. Dreadus contacts. Cylon IFFs all over the board. And they're flooding closed channels with news broadcasts. Under sustained missile strikes for its third day in a row with no relief from Colonial Fleet in sight. I don't think they're fake either. I just heard the Cap-5 Alpha Feed guy yelling about rocket damage to the Delphi Museum. They're retaliating. And while we're stuck out here, they're pushing the fight back home. Where they have more than four-fifths of Colonial Fleet to protect them. They are not helpless, Silas, and we don't have anyone coming to rescue us. Cut radio receivers and engage the enemy, Commander. Clear this area completely of any Cylon presence. I'm not sure if they're actually retaliating. I mean, maybe they are, but this might just be a means to mess with us. But no, we're not that important. We're just one fleet of ships. Yeah, no, humanity's fucked. Again. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. So say we all. Weapons free and by the numbers, folks. Escort clearance zone is active. I'm on it, Commander. Yes, Commander. Escort priority one, still online. Squadron is taking fire. Yes, sir.
got it. So say we all. Adamant is taking damage. Yes, Commander. Set secondary battery. Full attack mode. Defender is taking damage. Yes, Commander. Recalling squadron. Confirmed squadron target. Subsystem repairs are complete. I'm on it, Commander. IFFs have come back hostile. Come back hostile. Watch for clear. That's problematic.
Nothing but the rain. Target acquisition through. Give me manual controls now. That black walled up. Missiles incoming. Breaking. Push the line. That's what you get, crackers. Reaching. Bingo fuel. That's right, Cracker, that's right. No toast is gonna do me like that. Not today. Confirmed squadron target. Clean up order received. Rally on me. We've got them now. All hostile marks are dark, Commander. The blanket broadcasts have stopped as well. Downgrade to condition two and prep for real and cleanup. Sir, we must be done here. We're needed at Caprica. You dare not run from your post, Silas. Your Admiral can't protect you from treason charges. You can blame his political mess for the death penalty you'll face if you leave this post. Dreadus contact. A single raider bearing 147 Karam 062. Encrypted transmission incoming. Routing it straight to your CIC console, sir. I wonder. 